Hi, it's Nick here again with the Marketing Website Generator. Since we launched the new code, the Marketing Website Generator, based upon the Butterfly software, oh, about 27 minutes ago, I've already gotten a couple of requests to find out exactly what is different between the Marketing Website Generator and the Butterfly software that Mike is still releasing. And I wanted to take this opportunity to show you a couple of things. Um, first thing we're going to do is we're going to install a copy. Here I'm using our special installer. It's called the Ginstaller. It's a magic installer. Um, simply upload it to your website like I have here and click on it. And this is where I'm going to install it. So all I have to do is click the button and it's installed. Now I have to go through the actual configuration process. And so that's opened in a new window for me. It tells me what to do. I go and do it. I'm going to pause this while I set my database settings. Okay, we're back. I've gotten past that area and have gone ahead, as you can see, and uh, set up the database. So we go through there, and we're actually done with the configuration. Do you need to go back to the Ginstaller, scroll down a little bit, and get to cleanup right here? Because what that's going to do is that's going to move, you can't quite see this, can you? It's going to remove the uh, installation directory, the installer file, and the package. And then we can go directly to our admin and log in. And we're here. So what you'll notice is that it's pretty much the same as the Butterfly software. It's got three additional components. Now these are actually not part of the core. These are in the component subdirectory, which means that we have we now have control over this menu area. So we can add new functionality, new components to the system, and you'll be able to have those. For example, we We'll have a module manager and probably an integrated forum, a true help desk with ticketing and all that other good stuff that's all going to be able to come right into this section, at least for now. One big um, thing on the agenda for version 1.1, 1.2 will be to rebuild this administrator interface to make it much more usable. Than what it currently is but for now it works so if we click on add-ons we've already got a couple um, we've got a theme here and we've got Google Charts plugin so I'm gonna go ahead and install those boom that's installed boom that's installed okay so the next thing so he, here's your add-ons. We'll be adding those add-ons to Pro Package members over the next few days, and we'll make them available for sale as well. So we also have our Themes Manager. And as you can see, the Dark Water 2 was, was right here. Now I'm going to take a break from the Admin section here, and I'm actually going to go up to the front of the site and show you what that looks like. Okay, so these are two plugins that it comes built in as a little spinning earth. That's there so that you can kind of see what it's supposed to look like. And then we've got our themes. And so as you can see we've got our dark, our dark water too and this allows you to switch your themes. You might recognize that site right there because that's the one I'm actually using. Um, We've also got the new the new one that we just installed, as well as if you're running a computer site, you might like to use that one. And then, of course, we've got the plain old uh, BFM one. Now, the one that you see is called Default. I wouldn't recommend actually using that one. This one is here because WordPress requires a default theme to work. And so since we're using a lot of the WordPress code in here to make all this work, we have to have that default theme as well. But it doesn't actually work very well. The best one so far is a Networker 10. And we're going to be getting some more that work like that one up very shortly for you. Um, 
Now, to show you the update manager, I have to actually have an older version of the site. So again, I'm going to pause the video and I'm going to go and install an old copy of it so that you can see exactly how updates work for you. So what I've done is I've gone back and I've installed an older version of the marketing website generator in order to prove a point. So I'm going to go ahead and log in. And the first thing you'll see is I'm running an old version and there's a new version. And please upgrade now. Now this is very important because over the next few weeks we're going to be stabilizing the extension API as well as putting in quite a few bug fixes, some security enhancements, things like that. It's really important that you keep your site updated. Previously you had to go through and do some pretty sophisticated development to actually get a butterfly site upgraded. No longer. We take care of it all for you. You've got your check for updates right there. If there's a new update, we'll tell you about that. That gets checked every 24 hours. Um, if you want to check it more frequently, you can go to the add-ons and refresh software list. That will ask our server, is there anything new? Um, but right now we know there's something new, so we're going to click that please upgrade button and we're going to click that upgrade now button and boom we're back we're up to version 1.0 this will just magically work now we're not going to overwrite your templates we're not going to overwrite your settings we will upgrade the database if that's necessary and um, we will add new templates if those are necessary eventually those template systems is going to change so that all the data is stored in the database where it's a little bit more accessible so that's pretty much it I've covered the check for updates, I've covered the add-on manager, and I've covered the themes. Um, what's going to be really cool is when this list starts getting really big, as well as having a upload button here. Right now, if we don't have it, you have to FTP your extensions up, just like you would with WordPress. So, But that's going to be made even easier over the coming days. The marketing website generator is free. Just go on over to marketingwebsitegenerator.com, enter your name and email, and you'll be able to get a free copy. Um, there's also a way that you can get some support and some additional plugins. And I will see you on this other side.